scapular range of motion, you need to identify two landmarks. The acromion focus of the scapula, one hand will be positioned here, the other one will be touching the inferior angle of the scapula. The model can be lying side line facing the surface. One hand under the arm, cupping, this, cupping the inferior angle of the scapula, the other one over the acromion process. Now you can move the uh, scapula either into depression or elevation or abduction or abduction, upward rotation or downward rotation. Motion can be applied also from prone lying position. One arm over the shoulder, the other one cupping the inferior angle of the scapula. You need now to apply the scapular range of motion, elevation, depression, abduction, adduction, downward rotation, and upward rotation.